as part of a crew that staged a string of armed robberies in the United States, U.S., then blamed his conduct on the violent culture in his homeland, has been sent to prison for 10 years. Alex Josephs, 23, was sentenced in a Connecticut federal court yesterday, almost six months after he pleaded guilty to one count each of Hobbs Act robbery and brandishing a gun during and in relation to a violent crime, the office of the U.S. Attorney for the District of Connecticut disclosed. Josephs was also ordered to pay restitution totaling $298,073 U.S. dollars, the value of the losses from three of the 2021 robberies at stores operated by telecoms giant AT&T in the Connecticut towns of Newington, Enfield, and Canton. Shaquille Raymond, another Jamaican who was a member of the violent street crew, was given a six-year prison sentence on March 29th last year for his role in the robberies after he pleaded guilty to similar charges. He was ordered to pay $298,073 U.S. dollars in restitution. Both men face deportation after completing their sentence.